Parents and students, welcome back. Today we are looking at staccato playing and the song Raindrops on page 58. Uh, we are also back in C position, so make sure that we are not in our G position. We brought that back to C. Um, staccato playing, uh, it takes a little while to kind of get the hang of it. Um, a lot of times students think that you need to press your finger down really, really hard. You actually don't. Um, and it, well, you can. It doesn't matter. You can play it soft. You can play it loud. Really, the staccato comes after you've played the note. See how I just brought my finger up as quickly as possible so that that note doesn't ring out at all. So on raindrops, we're going to go from a 5 to a 1, 4, Excuse me, one, five, two, four, three, three, four, two, five, one, four, two, three, three, two, four, three, three, four, two. Now, it is not as simple as it looks. It's going to take some practice to really get that jump up. A couple of things to look out for. Don't bring your hand way up because it's going to take time to get back into that C position. You do want to hop your finger up, but not the hand. Try to just get that one finger to hop that's playing. And then, of course, remind them that they don't need to hit it really hard. I think a lot of that stems from going up and then trying to slam it back down. Just have that one finger bounce up. It's going to take a little bit of dexterity, so um, nothing to get frustrated about. Just you know, keep working at it. Think about it. Uh, one time I heard someone say, think about it like taking your hand off of like a burning hot, you know, whatever plate or stove or something. Your finger is just coming right up. All right, that's it for today. Thanks for watching.